Okay. Welcome to this lab. So I'm Max. I'm going to be your virtual TA of this semester. So let's have a brief introduction of this class. First, in this class, we're going to do circuit, electric field and potential, magnetic field, and light. Be more specific, we need to know how to connect the circuit based on the schematic. And also, we need to know the Kirchhoff's law, basically the resistance in parallel and theory. And also, we're going to learn more a little bit about uh, RC circuit, which is uh, really crucial for the modern so uh, society be because there's like radio, uh, radio wave is induced by that. And also, electric wave and potential. I'm pretty sure you're going to learn that really briefly in the really soon in the real lecture. Going to be pretty. Pretty interesting, and also the magnetic field. We're gonna learn a little bit more about uh, the induction, the Faraday's law, generator, so on and so forth. And last part, we're gonna learn a little bit about light. So we're gonna examine the wave part and also the particle feature of the of the light. So for the particle feature of the light, we're gonna learn a little bit about reflection, diffraction, and diffraction. Uh, for the wave part, which is a big part, we're gonna learn about atomic spectra, um, microwave, if, if you, we're gonna have that fun with mi microwave, uh, and also interference and uh, polarization. And bear with me if I miss anything, because I will be uh, the, all the material will be covering the following videos. And there's some suggestion I want to give it to you at the beginning of the class. Don't be shy. Ask your, uh, ask your classmate, ask your professor, ask your TA, especially TA, because sometimes they look intimidating, it's just because they're just nervous. So just ask them. Uh, and of course, it's a lab class. It's, I think it's supposed to have fun, so be creative. Try something you don't, even not in the book, but of course. Don't be too creative. Make the lab safe. <laughs> That's the first priority, of course. And of course, use all the help that you have. What I mean by all the help, sometimes you, you may forget. You have your phone, you have Google, you have, uh, you have Mathematica, which is the most powerful thing for calculus. Wink, wink, you may need to use that sometime. Um, yeah. Um, for instance, if you if you got the data, you can just take a photo. You don't need to copy it. I mean, that's my opinion, but it's really varied from other TAs or not. Anyhow, enjoy the class.